The thing that was so wonderful about your character and seeing you come back is, I think in our heads as fans, we were like, he's out there somewhere. And then we saw you in clear, you were like, he is not doing well. Uh, <laughs> but it, it definitely showed a dimension, or at least, at least maybe even a little bit of foreshadowing about what can happen, particularly for Rick. So what, what do you think he was doing this whole time out there? You know, he was painting. <laughs> He was getting to know himself. Um, I think he was... Um, well, we may find out this season what Morgan's been um, doing with himself, but um, uh, one of the things he's been doing is trying to find Rick, and, um, and at the end of the last season, he find, finds him and kind of wished that he hadn't. What kind of effect do you think Morgan's presence will have on Rick? Oh, um, I don't know, to be honest. I think um, Morgan and Rick have a particular kind of man love that kind of goes on and... Um, Keep going. <laughs> I think the, the, um, the fact that Morgan has gone to find Rick, I think one of the, I've said it before, but it's one of the things that's most important is Rick is the last person left on the planet that Morgan, that knows Morgan. Everybody else who Morgan knows is gone. And the only man, the only person left that Morgan knows is Rick and that's why he goes to find him. And um, I think Morgan's aware of the effect that Rick has had on him. Um, I don't know now because they meet at such a kind of important moment at the end of the last season and this season there's going to be fallout. Uh